10? She is not 10. She's much, much older than 10. How about you? Yes. They don't live until 100. Alright, for your information, alright? She's our oldest element, alright? She's 53 years old, alright? Jati here, she is 39 years old. Alright, so Kumali is 53, alright? She's the oldest element, alright? She's been with us, basically, yeah? Since the 1970s. Alright, she's so, she's been here longer than most of us. Kumali is the, our oldest element, so she has started to develop some, uh, the trunk, basically, alright? See the pinkish ears and the pinkish trunk. Alright, so the next time you are in Singapore Zoo, you can actually very easily, in fact, you can tell Komali apart from all you in your hand right now. Kindly proceed to Hard B for Denmark right in front of me here, right in front of the elephants to queue up for the token feeding session. And for those of you guys at Hard B right now, if you do not have the tickets with you, I repeat, if you do not have the tickets in, in your hand right now, I'm sorry, but you have to move up, uh, to move over to other sitting areas, alright? If you guys still want to see the elephants. Thank you.
water here right in front of you is because we're going to show you our elephant training session. Who's here excited to see some elephant training session by my channel here? Not everyone uh, can see elephant training session. Okay, how about you guys put your hands together for Kumali? Come on. You see, uh, you see what my trainer here, all right? He's holding this hand, uh, this very long stick that is holding right now. It's what we call a target stick. It's what we use to actually talk with the elephants, to communicate with Komali here, to tell Komali what we want Komali to do. Okay, so just by putting to raise up their feet, right, very high, it actually allow us uh, to uh, closely inspect their toenails. You see at the bottom of your feet, uh, they have these toenails. Uh. These toenails can actually get damaged, alright, over time if we never take care of their toenails. So basically what will happen, right, the toenails, once they grow too long, the toenails can actually crack open, uh, we get damaged, they have infection afterwards, right? So the infection will actually spread from their legs, to their entire bodies, alright? So, in order to prevent the infection from happening, we must actually take very, very good care of their toenails. Make, make it short, make it clean, and make it tidy as well. See, by asking the elements to turn around, alright? We can uh, even ask the elements to present their back foot as well. <laughs> Okay, what's going to happen next is my trainer here is going to ask the elephant, either one of them, to actually lie down inside the water. Alright, so they can clean their bodies down. Once Daki lie down, all of you must clap. All of you must clap. Yes. But these two elephants here, they love the attention. Okay, so right, this is a very big behavior for big behavior for them. After they do this set of behavior, we will actually reward them with a bigger tree. Alright? See their body is very clean, right? See, so when their bodies are clean, right, we can actually inspect the entire of their bodies, huh? make sure there's no physical injuries, like cuts. Abrasion because elephants fight. Uh, because elephants fight, some elephants will tend to get injured, alright? So, in order to prevent that, we must actually, every single day, so we must observe their bodies for any physical injuries. Right, so, after we check for their bodies, we will ask the elephants to open their mouth so you can see their teeth, alright? For the body, Jati, come, open your mouth. Kamali here will open her mouth big and wide. Eh? Uh, you can see elephants have teeth also. Eh? That's how they eat food. Eh? They cannot eat food. Right? And elephants, you know, humans swallow a lot of teeth, right? And elephants, eh, they only have four. Eh? Elephants only have four teeth. They have two teeth at the top and two teeth at the bottom. Right? But throughout their entire lifetime, eh, they will go through six sets of teeth. Eh? So once these four teeth falls off, alright? From the time they are young, eh, they will have another like five to six sets of teeth after that, alright? But once they reach around their 60s or their 70s, they will probably have loose all their teeth and they cannot actually eat any more solid food. Right? We will adjust their diet after that. Right, for our next segment, the Mali here will actually spray water to all of you here. No, I'm just saying, I'm just saying, it's dirty water, right? We cannot ask the elephants to do it. Alright, but the next segment is some volunteer session. Alright, from you guys, one question only, eh? Those of you who got the answer correct, we have a special prize for me and my colleagues. Enter the water here right in front of you. It's because we're going to show you our elephant training session. Who's here excited to 
people share excited to see some elephant training session by my trainer here. Not everyone uh, can see elephant training session. Okay, how about you guys put your hands together for Kumali? Come on. You see, uh, you see what my trainer here, all right? He's holding this hand, uh, this very long stick that is holding right now. It's what we call a tongue eight stick. It's what we use to actually talk with the elephants, to communicate with Komali here, to tell Komali what we want Komali to do. Okay, so just by Thank you. 